Hello again. Welcome everyone to Total War Elysium the second time today. My internet is now working again properly. Oh, I just realized my webcam's on as well. That's fine. Um, Ollie is still with me. He's currently away for a second. Oh my god, no. My internet started lagging again just now. Are you serious? That's unbelievable. It was working the whole time and now it's red again. Working again properly. Oh, I just realized my webcam's on as well. Beat myself as well. Oh, unbelievable. The internet seems to be not working anymore. Well, maybe this is uh, going to be a very, very short stream that is going to get deleted immediately because it seems... Well, I mean, a kilobyte per second appears to be on the number that it's supposed to be at. Oh, it's yellow, now it's green again. <laughs> okay, all right, it, maybe it's okay. Oh, God. It was... I, <laughs> 20 minutes ago, I said to Ollie, okay, it's it's been fixed. I, I was monitoring it. It was working the whole time. The stream starts and immediately drops down to red. Anyway, looks like we're good again. Welcome, everyone. Um, DDoS, I don't know. Maybe this person, but let's not mention him. Uh, anyway, so are you ready to play a game? I should play something different now. Let me go with this, this deck. Yeah, I'm going to... Do you want to play against my... My uh, unbeatable Marie Antoinette deck, deck again? Uh, sure, let's do that. Why not? <laughs> Alright, I'm queuing. Let me know. Okay. I'm going with my Goofram deck. This deck has the most legendaries out of all my decks. Which isn't saying <laughs> much, because I only have two, but still. That means you're definitely going to win, right? Well, judging from what you did last time, I imagine so, yeah. It's probably also one of my worst decks. What do we do? So you're playing Guthrum, right? I am indeed. What are you going to do about it? <laughs> I think we take this guy. Hello, Braden Clivekin. Imagine entering a queue and getting into a fight with someone else than Ollie. Yeah, this this happens sometimes on the Total War Elysium Discord. It's like a looking for looking for um, game kind of uh, channel, and people were like playing against each other, and then they queue up, and then they're like, "Oh, I came up against someone else." I'm like, "Okay, sure, just play your battle." All right, got nothing to play. I have peasants. Oh my goodness. And a short sword. <laughs> Good hand, right? Good hand. Um, well, I would say that this is not a bad response to that. For now. Hello, Andy. Welcome back, all of those who were here an hour ago. Well, you know what? I said this is not a bad response to it, but yeah, of course, you want to kill your stuff off, so I'm not <laughs> sure if that is yeah. really that relevant. At least you're not going to be able to do too many uprisings, because I don't really have a huge amount of... Like, this deck doesn't have a stupendous amount of minions on the board at all times. Hmm, yes. Uh, do I just draw this? I guess I will. Hopefully my peasants will be able to clear your shields. What if I just don't play anything, huh? What are you going to do then? <laughs> Is this the tactic? Are you winning, son? Well, he's on 19, I'm on 25 HP, so I'd say it's very clear who's winning here. Just gonna have to do this. Oh. An interesting move. <laughs> well, what do you say to this? Camera is not in sync with audio, but it doesn't really matter. It's about the gameplay. Is it really not? Hold on, let me try and reset it, see if that changed anything. I doubt it, but it seems to be fine on my end when I'm looking at OBS. Oh well. Uh, let's take all of this stuff. 
Hmm, you say uprising won't be that good, okay. <laughs> Unless you're trying to play mind games. Who knows? Who knows? Um... Oh, I definitely want these actually. Hold on, I can't do that. Uh, let's drop you. Take that. Okay. It's better. It's me being behind a few seconds with the video. Oh. <laughs> Never mind then, there was a lot. Hmm. Not really getting many cards that I want. Question for game design approach. Is the game mostly focused on units or abilities? Interesting. Well, we definitely have a lot more units. Um, the idea is to kind of have that Total War experience on a cardboard. Um, so the idea is that you want to set up your army and the events will enable you to, to do the cool so CCG plays. You didn't disconnect, by the way, right? Because you did nothing on turn four again. So I was like, "Yeah, I yeah, my 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 jaw is not that good." Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh oh. This is what we wanted. Ah yes. Ah kind yes. Of. It's not bad. Some fodder. Yeah, I mean it's gonna. Oh. Oof. Oof, okay. Well, I think this is gonna have to be a race. Can I, oh, well, I, oh yeah, I can do this. That's fine, I guess. All right, well, if I kill you, I gotta do it soon, because otherwise, I feel like one single uprising right now would already be mm. somewhat detrimental. So it's more about a good board and strong units than running a deck solely of burn cards and removal like what Magic the Gathering can do. Yeah, I'd, I'd say so. Oh, the Pyrrhic victory, you son of a gun. But there's definitely cards where such a bad draw this turn. It's definitely you can make a deck which is more about removal and burning cards. So Josh, who Donkey knows, he has a deck which is just structures and events. And the idea is you just build walls and you just try to erode the enemy. But it's not very common. No, yeah he uh he showed me that once. That was an interesting one. It was the events and structures deck. Mm-hmm. Yeah. God, I'm worried. Have you got aid to camp right now? Just instantly heal up for free. <laughs> no, he's abandoned me. Oh, right. Good. You said you like That's Assassin's good. Creed, so which one is your favorite? Uh, me? Two. No, me. Oh, uh, I like Assassin's Creed. <laughs> well, which one is your favorite, then? <laughs> what did you say? Three? Uh, two. No, three. Ugh. Oh. I mean, if I was, was right, say, but... I'll say you're such a hipster. <laughs> uh, yeah, two and say... Brotherhood and and uh, Revelations, like the whole Ezio trilogy, was for me definitely my mm. favorites. But to be fair, I kind of the uh, four was the last one I played. Like I didn't play Unity, Syndicate, etc. And then I played, I started playing again with um, Origins, but that I actually did part of a Let's Play on that. But that I tried running that on my current setup, and it is um like crazy laggy or sorry not laggy it uh, crashes um every once in a while that's kind of annoying yeah i actually i really enjoyed odyssey um but apart from that yeah two for sure which is the one after two is uh, brotherhood right uh yeah so yeah two was the and brotherhood and then mm -hmm. um Revelations, yeah. Nice.
Black Flag all the way. See, I, I feel like I remember from Black Flag, I don't remember much about it, but I remember from Black Flag that it was um, it was a really good game, but it wasn't really a Assassin's Creed game. It was more of just like an open world piratey <laughs> game. But it was a very good game. Hello, Squiddy the Squid Lord. And yes, I am Dutch, Marnix. Are there any shamelessly OP cards in the game yet? Well, Donkey, maybe you could answer that. Um, I very much like... Uh, ooh, I think you might be dead, by the way. No, you're not. Yes, you are. Hold on, let me kill you first, <laughs> and then... Mm-hmm. Oh, I had, I had two extra damage in hand as well. Anyway, um, yes, I my favorite deck is the... Well, my favorite character is the South Sao, and he has a couple of cards, or at least... The Free Kingdoms has a couple of cards uh, with the Mandate tag, which again, I'm, unfortunately, I can't show you the collection, but next Thursday. Um, but yeah, there's there's one which is Pearl Dragons, which when you uh, target it with something, um, it gives all other units on the field an extra action. So they can either move again or they can attack again, which is really good. And J Dragons, whenever you target it, it gives all other units on the same line, plus one, plus one. So you can really start stacking like a, you can make a really strong board in like a single turn like you have these swing turns it's basically like a combo deck um so yeah i think those are really good and also uh, open planes while itself is obviously just a it's a it's it's a really weak structure but it really makes a lot of big plays happen as well which is really cool in fact i will uh, try uh are you gonna go her again mm -hmm. okay then i'll go with my other salsa deck the one I showed okay. earlier on stream, but I, last time when we played, I played with my Open Plains deck and I lost. Mm -hmm. But now I'm going with the other Tsa deck. Let's see if that goes okay. better. Yeah, yeah. All right. I'm queuing oh, up Oh, sorry. Now. Yes, I am. Uh, yeah, queued already. But looks like we found each other. Yeah, but I don't think there's any shamelessly OP cards because uh, I like to say we're keeping on top of anything that feels too unfair. <laughs> Yeah, in the Discord is a list of cards that are on watch lists and stuff as well. I would say the there's one card right now for uh, Lagafa, the um, the free cost free five with flanking that discards your hand when it dies. That uh, Warmonger. Warmonger, yeah. For for mm. her specifically, it's really strong. But generally, it's a weak card. Well, it's not a weak card. It's a it's a good it's a well well balanced card. But for her specifically, it's just really strong. Yeah, that's definitely on the on the watch list. Yeah, which is a shame because it's a cool card. I noticed Sun Ren pop up as a silhouette. Is Sun Ren coming after Ding Big Dong? No, she's in al already right now, but I haven't unlocked her yet, unfortunately. But she's in. Uh, she, I think she's on the weaker side though. Compared to Cao Cao, I basically would never play her right now. Uh. You can have that. Do we have Yari decks yet? Not yet. There's no Shogun faction yet. But I have a sneaky feeling that will be coming. <laughs> Could I play Sunren? I don't think I have a, a Sunren deck on this account. Ooh, have you got it unlocked on this account? Have you got everything unlocked on that account? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> uh... <laughs> So we, we have we have uh, accounts uh, for, with the future content in as well that we play play tests on to test all the new stuff. So yeah, will there be some form of card rotation like there is in Magic and Pokemon? So I think there have been discussions around it. We haven't decided yet. It depends. It depends on uh, on how how. I guess how it goes, because obviously when you're adding cards in, um, you don't want to make it so every card is, every new card is more powerful, because you want people to to buy them. Yeah, it's kind uh, of what kind of feeling that Hearthstone has. Yeah, what does that call like power power creep? I think power creep. Yeah. Yeah. See, so the idea is you sort of retire cards, so you don't have this this sprawling kind of uh, amount of cards to pick from. Yeah, makes sense. Oh boy. The three cards in the deck, I think, are all the cards I need right now. Will there be a Shogun 2 faction? 
Uh, there can there will there will be any faction from Total War. Um, we have planned the next few, but obviously I can't reveal which ones. Uh, just you... just whisper it in the mic. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I think a lot of people. Uh, I don't know if it's your chat, but a lot of people will like want to see Shogun. Oh yeah, that's just my channel because I I used to be the Shogun Two YouTuber. Ah, when uh, when YouTube or when YouTube when Shogun Two became free to play um, a couple of weeks ago, hmm. my channel blew up during that week basically. Nice. Well, blew up as in as far as a channel can blow up from a ten-year-old game, but still. Right. I'd really like some... Well, I don't know what I want right now. Will there be risk slash reward cards? Like, discard X amount of cards in your hand and give bonuses for how many of you have discarded or draw as many? Um, not in the not in the near future. Um, yeah, I think adding... Adding sort of a new type of card, quite a big, quite a big deal. And you'll see as we add in new factions, they will have kind of signature mechanics that they they bring to the table. Except for armor, yeah. Oh, only historical titles are obviously uh, in this game. Well, not obviously, oh, yeah. but yeah. yeah, yeah. Ooh, the Polish Legion. I think I might lose this one. I'm not. I think. I'm not drawing anything I need. I bet you now I'm going to draw my do <laughs> one damage to the entire line. No, I didn't. Okay, thank you. You got your old man. I've got my old man. He's going to start doing some stuff, but drawing cards isn't exactly what I need right now. Yeah. You've got. You've got. The granddaddy. Come on. No. It's not what I need. Alright. I gotta just keep doing this. More cards, old man. <laughs> no! You fool. Alright. Yeah, okay, that's something. Um... I'd love to see like a, an evil version of the old man where he... He makes the enemy discard cards. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that'd be good. <laughs> Just the same card, but like nighttime. That'd be cool. And what he's got an evil smile. What, what was his name being? Because it's on Wandering Philosopher. We need we need some kind of relevant name. Uh hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna think on that. <laughs> good idea. And I would tell James, send her an email, like, in the middle of the night. I don't think I am winning, Alamadi. I think this might be, uh... There's a revolt. I haven't even hurt her yet. Yeah, because we're both kind of late game decks, but I'm more of a combo deck. No! My <laughs> philosopher. I feel like he would be a good, that would be a good court eunuch, but we already have a court eunuch in the game, so that doesn't work. Perched philosopher. Yeah, instead of wandering. Here come up the <laughs> plebeians. Yeah, he's he's been walk, he's been wandering all day, and uh, it's got to night time. <sighs> um. Okay. This is such a different game from from uh, the one we just played. Yes, very much so. Um, oh, feel like.
Mm-hmm. Okay. I think my Polish Legion is is your Pearl Dragons. Yeah, Polish Legion is just very solid. Is he? Oh no, I was going to say, is a short sword a peasant as well, but no, thankfully it is not. I too remember when the re revolutionary France fought Sao Well, that's the beauty of this game. <laughs> Anything can happen. Oof, the splash. Hmm. Someone just left a very short review of The Last of Us 2. Yeah, I saw that. Would you mind leaving my coral... Oh, you got short sword. Oh, I didn't realize you got short range on the short sword. Oh, well. <laughs> well. Um, almost out of cards, at least. Although, the two peasants per turn aren't helping. More peasants. <laughs> Release the peasants! <laughs> uh, okay. Yes, that's how it's going to do his own revolution. Hmm. Well, you've got a lot of cards there to choose from. I do. I do have some cards. Alright, let's just start with that. I'm out of cards. I did not realize that, that was going to happen. A minor mistake. Oh, wow. <laughs> The old man, he's, uh... He's done his job, I guess. I mean, that's... Yeah, that's something. <laughs> you've got all your cards. <laughs> Exhausted that. I've drawn nine more cards than you. There's a, is that going to be an achievement as well? <laughs> yeah. It should be. I get on the phone to James again. <laughs> In the middle of the night. Alright, this is going to have to just not draw a card then. That's a retreat. <laughs> Legit the biggest problem Donkey has in any card game. Too many cards and choices. Yep. I love I love having a big hand and lots of things to choose from. Yeah, I've always gravitated towards um aggro decks. Interesting. But in this game. Because it's only 18 cards, it just feels a bit more... Your combos are just a lot more simple. Or like... Sort of, you know, you can you can kind of build a deck around one concept. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> the peasants are revolting. What? I mean, they smell bad, yeah, but... <laughs> <laughs> there has to be something mean about it. Aggro Dex would probably be the best for farming XP and unlocking stuff because you play fast. Yeah, that's what I, I like to do as well. Oh, am I dead? No, not yet. Wait. Mm. Oh. Down to two. I need some cards to move forward already. Uh-oh. Ah. The short range, no. Ah, oh, damn it. I could have armed the mob and given them even more. You fool. <laughs> I shall surely lose now. Well, you've had... How many Drowned in Flames have you had? Two? Yes. I should so have kept should... one, as it turns out. Okay, you don't have one. That's good. No, no, I have three more in hand, but just don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to show my hand. Oh god, yeah. Without the short range, I would have been fine. But that short range really done me in there. Uh, this has got to be. Nope, not that. Can matches go on forever? Yes, they can. All right, watch uh, me draw a brown of flames. Nope. All right. <laughs> Kill me. You didn't believe. And yes, execute me. Pain. I am indeed winning a game. It does. It does happen. So <laughs> at least once. Uh, at least once. A. Uh, shall I just? I've got Pyrrhic victory in hand. Shall I? Shall I just show that off? Uh, yeah, sure. You can kill her with. Um... 
with the the mob anyway. Yeah. I really Just should add a bigger to <laughs> The mob is surrounded to that time. Yeah, I should really I should craft Pure Victory, I think, and put it in this deck, because I, I need some kind of comeback mechanic. Hmm. Alright. So you've yeah. beaten both my Tata deck. I think she's just really good against the Tata. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's go with this one. I don't know what you're going to go with, but let's do something different. Cool. I'm queuing up now. Yeah, me too. I'm, I'm going to try and get this Guthrum deck to work. Ooh. Is that a potential issue the designers are considering? I could see two control decks just sit and throw cards at each other without taking HP down. Or is that not physically possible? Mm. I mean, it's it. You can definitely have games of attrition, right? I mean, we we last time we, I was on your stream, we had that. Yeah. But um, eventually. Because uh, that, that's the main thing is that there's a couple cards that are really good at removal, like Pyrrhic Victory that was played just now, which is a legendary card, which means you can only be played about once per game. So there are some other ways of removal too, but then you have to draw usually multiple cards, like for example, uh, was it Reform or something? Like where everything gets one HP? Um, oh, uh, yeah. Uh, regime, regime something? Change, regime, regime change. change, yeah. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, like you have cards that are fairly good at removal, but usually you have to combo with something else. So it's it's not like generally there will be eventually someone that kind of breaks through. And yes, there is an, uh, a timer for your turn, so you can't just. Okay. Luckily. Uh, I think he means like. Because some people do that, and then like they take forever to take their turn. Oh no! Oh, you mean every turn they take? Yeah. They take a long time. Mm. I'm assuming nothing's in place yet, but I'm I'm sure that's something that you're also. Yeah, I'm wary not sure of. if. Yeah, because um, normally the time will be faster, right? Yeah. If someone times out, yeah. You've got an eight to camp in there, don't you? Yeah, I'm not going to attack you. <laughs> I just realized. You're not going to attack me at all. <laughs> Never. Well, not with my general anyway. I'm not going to waste unnecessary health on him. Um, yeah, I need to... I need to make some changes to this deck because... Like, early game draw is, is just not very good. I see. Love that value that the artillery officer can get. Mm. He loves it. He loves them cannons firing. <laughs> it's your favorite card, Donkey. No, Sappers! You betrayed me! <laughs> oh man, did I, did I not expect that card to show up? Holy crap. <laughs> okay. All right. That's the first structure you've played all day. Yeah, I don't have a lot of structures. I mean, I have the Open Plains deck, which has Open Plains, and then this deck, and I... F is there... I think I have High um, high Ridge in one other deck, but I can't even remember which one right now. Uh, oh, actually, yeah, I have it in the, um, in the Lagafa deck as well. Mm. But yeah, I don't have a lot of structures. I have Sappers in every deck as well, and I'm currently considering not having that, because it, it does legitimately not make a whole lot of sense anymore. Yeah. Because I don't ever see anyone, well, at least not you, and I play a lot against you, playing um, any structures, really. Uh, yeah, let's not take any unnecessary damage. Should have taken out that cannon, shouldn't I, first? Yeah, well, I got lucky that I drew the artillery officer. Where have you been, Donkey? I didn't see you streaming. Well, here I am, streaming. Hello. <laughs> uh... 
Will this be free to play? Yes. Well, on PC, uh, Steam, Steam and mobile. Indeed. Right. You know, it's kind of funny. I've never really felt any love for... Ooh. Interesting. I've never really felt any love for Empire and Napoleon Total War, like all my viewers notice as well. Mm -hmm. But ever since I started playing with Napoleon and, and Elysium, I've kind of wanted to try out Total War Napoleon. Because yeah. I've, I've barely ever touched it. So it's like, hmm. What is this doing do you not, to me? Do you not like the... Uh... Gunline battles. The muskets. Yeah, well, not necessarily muskets, just guns and... Like, I, it's kind of weird, because I love Fall of the Samurai. It's my... Mm -hmm. Well, I guess now it's my third favorite Total War game, because uh, uh, Free Kingdoms is first now, and Shogun 2 second, and then Fall of the Samurai third. But even so, I I don't know. For some reason, it clicks for me. And then with the with Empire and Napoleon, I just... I never... At least at the time, I never really felt any love for it. And I guess I still don't necessarily, but I'm getting more... I'm getting I'm getting gun curious, I guess. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, as we spoke about last time, big fan of big fan of sharp. And Bernard yes, Cobble. yeah, yeah, yeah. You told me that, yeah. And actually, the the dev team as well. I know it was. I think the plan was to go for uh, Britain for Empire fa first faction, but. Uh, I think we already had, uh, you know, we wanted to make it a bit more, a bit more global. Yeah. And France, revolutionary France is a lot more interesting. It is, it is very interesting, yeah. And then Marie Antoinette coming out of nowhere. Mm-hmm. Out of left field. I'm liking this uh, relatively slow versus relatively slow deck. Ooh, the volley coming out. Somehow my calf getting caught up in that. <laughs> hmm. Not been drawing the cards I want to draw, unfortunately. I think we're just gonna pop this out. Ooh. Oh, you've got the perfect aid to camp set up just now, I just realized as well, this daybreak. <laughs> You're probably like, yes, attack me with your messenger. <laughs> Go on. Stream is back. Hello, you take. Yeah, it was, uh, frames were dropping earlier, but it, I called the provider and it seems to be okay again now. I'm just gonna have to do this. Say I like it. Not looking too good for me at the moment. No, I'm sure uh, that aide de camp is gonna help out a lot. He's somewhere. He's somewhere. Oh, have you not drawn him yet? <laughs> Who knows? This is this is not what I need. What is what is going on right now? Um, this is such a waste if you do have him. Okay, so that'll be eight. Uh, nah, nah, I shan't. Oh. Especially if you got the aid to camp in there and just. Yeah, what a turn, right? That was good stuff. Very cautious. This, well, not even that. I just can't really play any other thing out of my hand. It's all trash. <laughs> I was here for the end. It was horrible. Yeah, it was... I don't know what was going on with my internet there. But luckily it's fixed now. Ah. He's going for the extra draws. Oh? Oh, fine. Okay, right. You were thinking about giving him shield, but... 
<laughs> Alright, can we this freaking card please? Then I'll take that one. I need better card draw in this, I think. I, like, I have a lot of it, but all my uh, fresh orders are stuck in my deck. I've not drawn any of them. Mm. Oh, well, there you have one. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> all right, so that's going out. Then there come the fresh orders. Okay. They are fresh. The freshest orders I've ever seen. Okay. Now we're talking. Let's lock that. And then finish that. Oh, smack that! All right, all the cards I needed were right there. Hmm. The raid is at dawn. Be there or be square. Uh, might just have to do this now. Oh, how could you? All right, leave me no choice, sir. <laughs> but to shoot me in the face. Exactly. should be interesting. Can't wait to try this game, seems interesting. Well, without speaking out of place, I would definitely sign up sooner rather than later. Because it looks like people are getting invites soon. There's a link in the description to the sign up page and any other info you might need on Elysium. As well as of course Ollie here being a walking information machine. That is true. Okay, let's see what you're, what you're cooking in there. Well, you're not gonna like it. In these French kitchens. Ah. Yeah. Are you just gonna play that twice? Uh, well, I could do, or I could just do individual little round shots of which I have <laughs> five in hand as well. Oh wait, uh, let's finish you off with style. See, I had... That aid de camp just came too late. Ugh, it's annoying as well, because I after you did the Pyrrhic victory, I actually had the planned uh, ground barrage, or what was it called again? The, the free cannons card planned. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Um, which I, I could have played, but I was like, well, I'll just kill you with damage instead. <laughs> Oh, I have, I have, I have a reward available, which I know is my 350 amethyst, which will allow me to recruit another character. But I can't show it on stream, <laughs> unfortunately. So it'll have to be next time. But next time, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have another character available. So probably gonna be Marine Toinette, unless Dong Zhou is just around the corner. But I think he's not yet. Yeah, you'd, you'd know if he was. <laughs> you'd hear him yeah. coming. Yeah. All right, let's go with. Let's take this one again. I'm ready to queue. Which one are you taking? I'm not going to tell you. Okay, I'm just wondering <laughs> if I should play South South, but I think everybody's seen a lot of South South, so I'm queuing up now. All right. Yeah, I was like, that's why I specifically said I'm taking this one because I didn't want to, mm -hmm. didn't want to give it away. Give it away. Do you still play Shogun Two? Uh, from time to time. It's not. I prefer Free Kingdoms now as my like go-to Total War game, but I still like it. I'm still, I'll still play it on the channel for sure. My go-to lag of a starting hand. First time I see your face completely different than I expected. I'm, I'm sorry? <laughs> so.
So why did developers choose Marie Antoinette? Why not some woman that actually mattered, like Elizabeth II of Russia or such? Well, that's, that's a bit harsh. <laughs> What's Marie I Antoinette mean, ever done to you? Also, did Russia have an Elizabeth II as well? Yeah, that's what he said, Elizabeth II of Russia. Hmm. Well, um, first off, the faction is uh, French Republic. Um, and also the cool thing about Marie Antoinette is that uh, she turns into the revolutionary mob. Yeah, and there's a guillotine card in this game as well, which is a legendary, so I haven't got it yet, but... Yeah, so technically she's, you know, she's the one who oversees all the peasants' deaths. <laughs> uh, and, and forces them to revolt, and then you can play the, the revolution mob as well. I like the way you said that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I think Marie Antoinette's going to be my, my next character because the only two I haven't got are Marie, Marie Antoinette and um, Sun Ren. And um, not a huge fan of Sun Ren, and I think there's some really cool decks you can make with Marie Antoinette, as you've already been displaying as well. I think that, that'll be a fun one. Let's go... That's I'll pop you out there as well, why not? Oh shit, because the uprising, that's why not. <laughs> Can't wait to blast those pesky Vikings with Grand Battery, yes. Yeah, it is fun. Sorry, Elizabeth the first or Catherine the second, that's what he said now. Merge them into one. No! <laughs> but I love um, him. Ooh. Thanks for the raid buffs. <laughs> yeah, we're basically like helping each other. Yeah. You kill off your minions, you give me some damaged minions. Minions. Units. Units, await my orders. How, how dare you say minions? I know, right? What is this? Some kind of. Hearthstone clone. Mm. Right. Um. Are you back for the day then, Internet Fix? Well, I'm only allowed to do another 15 or so minutes of this um, because of embargo reasons. But uh, I will be back to streaming again tomorrow, as per usual. So it should be all good. Um... Okay. It's an interesting play. But it works. <laughs> oh, I see. Very clever. Yeah, didn't have enough mana to empty my hand otherwise, so fine, I'll just shoot my own high ridge with a axe to the face. Low blow. Yeah, that, it, it didn't mean to come out like that. Because <laughs> I'm actually tired of oh, the uprising. I'm tired of the people saying it's a clone of this or a clone of that. So I didn't mean it like that at all. Not a short sword. Ooh, that's a nice draw. Like that. Oh, hello. Yeah. Okay. Another one of the Yes! Good throw! Nice one. <laughs> oh, that was poor. Okay, well, you're definitely revol uh, revolting? Re revolutionizing? Mm -hmm. Next turn? Revolving. Revolving? That's the one. Revolving, yep. <laughs> yeah, I will be. Um... Oh, sweet. You take 10 bucks. How many characters when it fully finally gets released? Sorry, I saw your question as well, and then I totally... Didn't answer it. I'm s thank you for the $10, though. Um, I believe the plan is to have nine characters at release, but I don't know if that's still exactly the way it's going to work. Yeah, at least nine. At least nine. There you go.
Ooh. Here cometh the peasantry. <laughs> All right. Most satisfactory end to our discussions. Let's just smack that down. Oh dear. Well. I uh, can't... Oh yeah, let's actually make sure that that hits her. And then... Is that guaranteed to hit... I don't know if it's guaranteed to hit that one, but that's perfect. Okay, she does still chuck torches, even though it can't hurt her. Okay. Mm -hmm. But yeah, the only thing we know about next characters is that Dongzhou is next. Um, but besides that, I know I don't know anything either yet. I'm sure all he knows, but he's keeping his lips <laughs> sealed shut. Yeah, I know. I'm so mean. Still got the Shogun 2 donation sound. Are there 3K sounds similar? I'm not sure. I actually I need to have a look at that at some point because I do. Yeah, my whole channel is still around, like based around Shogun 2. Ooh, the resume change. Like my merchandise is all Shogun 2 based as well. Although I am planning on doing some Free Kingdoms merch at some point. Um, but uh, yeah, I need to do some new, new donation sounds from Free K at some point. I think mean, that'd be cool. Well, it doesn't look like I'm getting out of this one alive. You're going to sacrifice yourself. Is there going to be a British yeah. character? Probably. It's in a, a faction, yeah, I imagine. I imagine so. Oh, damn. I, I thought I'd empty my hand and then that was going to go up to five damage, but whatever, fine. I'll just do it that way. <laughs> Historical end to Marie Antoinette. Well, I would have had to play a um, uh, guillotine for that, but not quite. I think we have I'm time for sure one more at least. Yeah, yeah. Well, I got my legendary battle pack unlocked. Ooh, nice. Nice. Let me uh, let me ask the the viewers. What do you guys want to see out of these five decks? Which ones? Which one would you like to see? Let's say without this one, because I I've played that one several times now. I actually haven't shown this one on st on this stream yet. I have on the first stream I did. But I'll let you guys have a quick choose. Napoleon. Napoleon again. Okay, two two votes for Napoleon already. And that's it. Oh, another Napoleon. Okay. It's looking like it's going to be Napoleon. Cao Cao. Oh, there's two Cao Cao decks, though. Mandate of Heaven. <laughs> maneuverability. Okay. Napoleon again, though. I have started to like the Napoleon deck more and more. I'm actually quite comfortable playing it now. Maneuverability. Well, it's kind of a toss-up, but let's, um, let's go for Napoleon, then. Maybe we have time for one more after that. We'll see. Unlikely. Cool. Well, I'm queuing up now. We're going to have an Empire Showdown. Ooh, another Marie Antoinette. Oof. Okay. I'm going to start building her deck after this. Although it doesn't mean I'm... I was so, I was so close to um, unlocking another Legendary. Because I just crafted uh, Saga. Mm -hmm. Which is so good. But I have like 960 point like uh, crafting material. So I was going to craft on the Legendary. But if I unlock Marie Antoinette, I'm going to have to unlock a bunch of cards for her as well. So, no legendary for me for a little while, I'm afraid. Mm -hmm. And that one. Alright. Oh, not a great not a great hand for me. I like hearing that. Oh wait, no. It's fine. I lied. <laughs> Ooh. Slight. Oh no. Did you play? Yeah, you played the... Oh no, my game crashed. I'm not even joking. That's the first time I've actually seen this crash. What the hell? Yep. Really? Okay. Yeah, I got like a weird... Um... Well, not weird. Just like a little bar saying Unity something and then it just crashed. Oh damn. <laughs> it's because I was losing actually. I just all the Ford. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Alright, I'm ready to go again. Damn it, I'm not going to get that opening hand again. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, I was just going to say, did you play the short swords first on purpose so it would take damage so that you would it would die sooner? I'm queuing up again. Alright. A shameful display. I'm sorry. <laughs> I wonder if in the future we will have mainstream card games featuring Hitler or such. Well, I imagine that will happen at some point in the future. I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, there are games that have it. There's a um, Sniper Elite has a mission where you, you kill Hitler. Mm. But, uh, yeah, it's not really a... I, I imagine he wouldn't be a playable character in this game, but hey, what do I know? <laughs> well, I was going to say, I don't have the opening I had just now either, but actually you ruined my opening, so I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, not a strong for me. Well, we can both be weak then. Inglorious Bastards, the card game, yeah. <laughs> I imagine the player base of such a game would be horrible, yeah. There's a, um, I think there's a World War II card game called Cards or something. Hmm, yeah. <sighs> yeah. I think there are, uh, I think they're the only other historical CCG. Yeah, but that one's like purely um, based on World War II, right? Or, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sniper games. Love those games. They was my favorite thing to play. The kill animations are fantastic. Yeah, I I and I enjoyed the like slow-mo sniper bullet flying towards your target. That was always fun. Oh, what a coward. All you have to do is sit there with your little scope looking at the enemy. <laughs> Ooh, the blood, the sun as well. He probably he probably saw something too scary, like uh, <laughs> an angry mob on the hill. Yeah, he saw something out of Warhammer coming towards him. He's like, ah, I don't want to deal with this. Alright, well. Will there be any Roman characters for this? You just have to wait and see. <laughs> I'm afraid. I can say that there are some cards in the game already that are somewhat Rome themed, that are timeless cards. So. Similar to how there are some cards that look like they're straight out of Shogun 2. Um, that are timeless cards as well. Oh, how very kind of you. <laughs> was that on purpose? Oh, uh, wait. Yeah, that was... Uh, I think cause I tried to play them on the front line. And then, yeah. Mind. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. I'm just trying, I'm trying to help you win, man. Ah, uh, thank you. I, I need it. Uh, take him. Ah, oh, this guy's weak. Don't want him at all. Oh, I need that, yes. Um, let's go with this. No, let's go with that one. Alright. Figured it out. The dev said something about most of the war games. Except more will probably be added. Yeah. Right, well, I'll free kill that. Thank you. Unless that was just like, you were just baiting me. That was the plan all along. It's like, <laughs> he's gonna fall from my trap. The fool. <laughs> oh boy, man. I, how can you, can you imagine this many cards in hand? You just have no, no real good plays here. I can't believe that. Well, you're... Oh, wait, I have this. Right, that, that does make sense, actually. Well, you're going to have to believe it. Nope. <laughs> nope, I refuse. <laughs> Get your nonsense out of here. All right, let's play that. Have it. He's biding his time. I wonder which hero they will add from Shogun 2. I hope it won't be Oda or Tokugawa. I would like Shins and Takeda, though. I'm sure, well, I imagine if there's going to be actual, like, generals from Shogun 2 in the game, I would not be surprised if 
Oda Nobunaga would be one of them. You and how do you, do you know how to pronounce that by the way? Enrage or something. It's Which one? The French, uh, the yeah, Enrage. Yeah, Enrages. I'd say Enrage. Yeah, probably. I did French at school. I'd say Enrage. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Well, uh, God, this is one that it's just the situation of having too many cards in hand. What to do? <laughs> Just now I couldn't play anything, and now I've got too many things to play. Alright, let's just do that. That's got to go. And I'll pop you at the back, why not? Alright. Here it comes. Vive la Révolution! Mm -hmm. Am I excited for the upcoming Battle Brothers DLC, Blazing Deserts? Yeah, I think when that comes out, I'll be going back into it again. Oh, what? why did I put this in? What kind of a fool am I? Um... Seriously, can I can I get some some card draw, please? <laughs> I still have the damn supply cash in my hand. Like, what is what is up with that? <laughs> wow, this is definitely like Waterloo era Napoleon. He's a bit past his prime. Yeah, seems like it. He's like, I'm back, guys. I'm back. <laughs> I've got all these cards. But I don't know what to play. Um, my hand's almost full as well. What have I got? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Okay, I'm alright for now. You know what? Let's just let's just pop this guy down. Let's get him out of here. Can't do anything with that. But, well, it's it's a it's a two mana one free, I guess. Two supply one free. Sorry. Hmm. Battle Brothers is quite small scale, but it's a great game. Yes. Is Battle Brothers the mercenary army? Yeah, it's basically um, Mountain Blade, but really small skill and turn-based combat with terrible RNG. I have to do this now. Well, I think I might be okay with that. Come on, that's not it. <laughs> Daybreak next turn. Okay, that's good. Um, You've got two minutes to to win. Oh again. no! <laughs> well, luckily, I've, I've, I think I've got a few minutes spare from the forest, so it should be okay. Because the first stream was like one hour and fifty-six minutes or something. But yeah, I need to start thinking quickly. Just give me all the cards. <laughs> I don't care. Uh... uh, yeah, fine, fine, fine. fine. Can't wait to play Julius Caesar and slap Napoleon. Oh, that'd be cool. Call your old guard, you'll lose. Oh, is that the legendary? I haven't got them unlocked yet. Oh, there's the boys. <laughs> the boys are back. The boys are getting armed. Now just don't, just don't, don't do a sudden barrage. Well, I can't promise anything. Just don't, just don't do it. Well, all right then. <laughs> it wasn't sudden rush. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. 
It was another type of cannon shooting ability. And let's actually just get rid of that one too. Why not? Get them all out of here. Pop this guy down again simply because I just need something, please. Anything I'll tell you. <laughs> um, yeah, let's make sure you don't get too strong. God, there's just a couple of cards I'm waiting for here. You down. Oh no. <laughs> oh no no. Okay, well that was some more terrible cards I don't need right now. Okay, alright, that's that's something. Let's pop you back. I'm gonna have to play you. And then we're gonna have to uh, I have to play that. Let's get rid of as much stuff as possible. Crap, I haven't got anything on the front line. Um, you know what? Get out there. And you. Get out there, you rich. Get in there, tactician. It's time to fight, friend. Do I really? Yeah, I'm gonna have to. All right. Got something of a board. <laughs> That's true. Oh. <laughs> oh, don't tell me you got blot out the sun. Oh! No. <laughs> I had a sneaky feeling that might happen. Yeah. I think I might be able to... Oh, right away! Oh, what? Again, blot out the sun. And um, I saw something targeted at me as well. Yeah. Gonna return the favor. Oh, no! The round shots, of course, you got two left. <laughs> yep. Nice one. Oh, his entire hand is empty. Beautiful. Yeah, that was... Uh... Was the one though. How many daybreak? I didn't draw my draw my card draw once again. Unbelievable. Mm. Anyway, a good game to finish on, I reckon. Yeah, definitely. Cool. Well, uh, yeah, since I'm almost over time here, I'm gonna end the stream quickly. So thank you all once again all for watching. Make sure to sign up. There's a link to just about everything you need in the description. There's one to the sign up for Elysium, there's one to the FAQ, there's one to the Discord, uh, and there's also one to the first stream I did. Uh, a, a week ago as well in case you want to see more Elysium. I'll put a link into the one that I did earlier this afternoon as well before my internet went wild. Um, so yeah, I'll, Ollie, unless you've got anything else to say to add to that? Uh, no, I think you've summed it up pretty nicely. Yeah, head to the, uh, the website to sign up if you want to get access um, as soon as possible. We will be sending out beta invites uh, in the future, not too distant future. And join the Discord as well where you can I'm so there too. Tell... I'm very active. Yeah, you... Yes, you can ask Donkey for tips and uh, tell him off for playing decks that are too strong. <laughs> uh, and also, one final thing, uh, their next embargo drops next Thursday, so I'll be streaming it again next Thursday as well, and I'll at that point be allowed to show you the collection, the store, uh, I'm pretty sure everything actually, just so I'll be able to show off everything in the game, and maybe I'll build a deck uh, live as well so you guys can see how that works. Um, so yeah, that's that. Yeah. Okay, cool. Uh, thank you guys all for watching. Hope I'll see you all uh, again soon. I'll be streaming, by the way, tomorrow as well, uh, Gordian Quest. See you all then. Have a good day and goodbye.